clean up first. In this episode, we're gonna talk about inches, feet, and yards. Here we have a tape measure. This tape measure goes from zero to 72 inches. Zero to 72 inches. That means it covers six feet because we are learning in this episode that 12 inches is one foot. So, a six foot measuring tape covers 72 inches. It's that distance. Show. Yeah, Rowan, you're still 72 inches. I am 72 inches tall. Okay, show the class again how long 72 inches is. Ready, go. Six feet. Six feet, 72 inches. No, Do it again, ready? Back. Oh, okay. When you're done using the tape measure, you just let it retract. Okay. And there you go. Let's okay. Let's see how long the fire truck is first. Take your tape measure and extend it from one point to the other. It's 18 inches long and half an inch. Almost 19 inches. Okay, so that's about a foot and a half and a little left over. Hold it there, hold it there, don't let go. This keyboard is 28 and a half inches, as he says. You start at the bottom and you go all the way to the top and it looks like it is 28 and a half inches where the white keys start. Start at the bottom, go to the top. 20 and a half inches. You just take your tape measure and extend it like Hezzy did. 20 and a half? All right. So that's between one and two feet. Now we're gonna do the paper shredder. Now notice the paper shredder is not plugged in. That cord there in the bottom is unplugged. That's how the paper shredder should be so that everything is safe. Hezzy says it is 21 inches tall. He just used his tape measure and that it is 21 inches tall so that's one foot and nine inches because two feet would be 24 inches so it's between one foot and two feet Welcome okay how long is it 28 and a half inches, all right. 29? 29 inches, so it is two feet and five inches. It is two feet and five inches. All right, so it's how many inches? 46 and a half. 46 and a half inches, so it is almost 48 inches, which would be four feet tall. It is 36 inches or three feet because it goes 12, 24, 36. 36 inches is three feet. He's measuring from the top of the chest to the bottom. Very good, Hezzy. If you extend it, 12 inches, 24 inches, 36 inches, 48 inches, and 60 inches, that's five feet. You go to 72 inches, that's six feet. All right, show the class how far six inches is. Ready and go. Don't bonk. Woo! There we go. That was six feet or 72 inches. Here are 36 inches. Starts here and goes all the way over there. That's 36 inches or three feet. That's one yard. Very good. Three feet is one yard. And in American football, we have a football field where they have to go 100 yards from one end to another. Two teams fighting over yards, 100 yards. That's American football. So we use yards in North America, specifically in the United States of America, to describe three feet at a time. One yard is three feet. Yeah. How many inches are in 300 feet? 
Whoa. Well, one foot is 12 inches, so 300 feet would be 3,600 inches. That's how long a football field is. 3,600 inches. Good gravy. I want to be as tall as a tree, swaying in the breeze, as far as the eye can see. Okay, so here's Hezzy's foot. It's roughly at the start of zero inches, and his foot is just about six and a half inches. So that's how long 12 inches really gives us some perspective here. Or rather, I should say, to get some perspective on 12 inches, this is how long 12 inches really is. It is twice as much as Hezzy's foot right now, roughly. 12 inches in one foot. So that is two feet or 24 inches. Two feet or 24 inches. Here's how you can measure how tall you are at home. Step one, put your feet right against the wall. Step two, take your tape measure and hold it to the ground. Make sure you get an adult to help you out here. You can usually tuck it into the trim board. Nope, 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 stay right there, stay right there. Keep your heels against the trim and you can use the tape measure the little hook at the end of the tape measure, you can use that to start your measurement. So step one, heels against the wall. Step two, tuck the tape measure in to the trim. Okay, don't move. <laughs> don't move. You can see how tall you are. Okay, Hezzy is about 43 and 7 eighths of an inch. 43 and 7 eighths of an inch. Hezzy was about 43 and 7 eighths of an inch. 43 and 7 eighths of an inch. So he's almost 44 inches. 43 and 7 eighths of an inch. So almost 44 inches. So he's bigger than 3 feet. Boom. Here's 3 feet. 3 feet. And he's smaller than whoa, 48 inches, which is 4 feet. Three feet, four feet, three feet, four feet. He's between the two of these. I'm Keenum, K-E-E-N-U-M. That's how you spell my name. And you can find key numbers right here at this website or on this channel. We'll talk about miles in a different video. 5,280 feet make up one mile. Whoa! If you want more videos like this, hey, subscribe to the newsletter, Mom or Dad. Let's grow this channel together and reach kids with math content that they can learn at their own rate. See you guys next time. God bless. Okay, Hez is going to help me measure and confirm that I'm six feet tall, which will invariably stretch the limits of this tape measure. I'm gonna have to take over. Oh snap, here we go. Running out of room. Actually, that's the six foot marker right there. So as you can see, I am six feet on the nose. So step one was put your heels against the wall. Step two is to put the tape measurer down below. I'm done growing vertically. I might get a bigger belly, which means I will be growing horizontally. 
But as far as growing vertically goes, I am six feet tall, which is how many inches? 72. 72 inches. Now raise it down. And here we go. Woo! Clean up. Oops. 